Laws.com Legal Forms Guide The Form DS-2019, known as the Certificate of Eligibility for Exchange Visitor Status, is the primary document used in the administration of the Exchange Visitor Program. The Form DS-2019 permits a prospective exchange visitor to seek an interview at a United States Embassy or Consulate. These interviews are mandatory to obtain a J visa and subsequently enter the United States. The Form DS-2019 will identify the exchange visitor and their design sponsor. In addition, the Form DS-2019 will provide a brief description of the exchange visitor's program, including the start and end date, the category of exchange, and an estimate of the total cost of the exchange program. The DS-2019 form begins with basic questions, which will ask for your full name, your gender, and your place of birth. The next sections of the Form DS-2019 will ask questions concerning your country of citizenship. The form requires you to offer your country of legal permanent residency and for the position in that respective country. This question simply means that you must list your profession, such as a professor, a graduate student, or a government researcher. After you have satisfied the aforementioned information, you must satisfy questions concerning your address outside of the United States and your current address within the U.S. if such information applies. The next section of the DS-2019 form will ask you questions concerning the purpose of your request for the E-1 visa. This section offers two checkboxes or bubbles where you will select either I am beginning a new program accompanied by immediate family members or I am transferring from another institution or school's J-1 program. After you have inputted your reason for request, you will list the coordinating program dates and the appropriate category for which your requested J-1 visa falls under. Along with this information, you must write a brief description concerning your activity. The next questions will require you to submit the appropriate subject or field code, the location where your activity will be accomplished, who is offering your financial support, and the amount of financial support you are receiving. To watch more videos, please make sure to visit laws.com.